I'm Quinn Hatfield. I'm the chef and owner of Hatfield's Restaurant here in Hollywood on Melrose. Hatfield's is a fine dining restaurant. It's California French. We have an amazing access to produce here. Uh, kind of gives us the opportunity to play around with things that are right in season at that time. And so we try to sort of have the best of that in the food. Oh, they even have cooks at the bar. That's what oh, I like. You know, it's a classy spot. <laughs> hey, nice mustache. Thank you, thank you. So this is my friend Carl. Nice to meet you. Kat. Nice to meet you. He's one of the best bartenders around. I'm excited. I mean, how can you not have a good time with a mustache like that? You guys are making me blush. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies. <laughs> we don't even have any drinks in us yet. All right, All right. I, I, can, I can fix that problem. I know, what, so what do you recommend? I do have a fun one now called the Spicy Pigeon. Also the Cucumber Mint Gimlet's a great drink as well. Well, I'll be here for the evening. We want to rock and roll with those? Yeah, yeah that's All right. do Let's do it. So right now I'm making the Gimlet. Uh, I just squeezed half a uh, fresh lime in there, a little mint. We actually take cucumbers and we infuse it with the vodka. So the vodka literally comes out a green, hueish tint Ooh, like that. A little soda. You look like you know what you're doing. I've been around the block a couple times. <laughs> Cucumber gimlet. Looks beautiful. Now we're gonna compose the spicy pigeon. So half a fresh squeezed lime, an ounce of fresh wheat grapefruit, some organic jalapenos. We do about a half ounce of agave. A who? <laughs> and we're going with the uh, reposado tequila. And look at that shake! Wow, well, I'm excited to Cheers, try. Ladies. Cheers, ladies. Cheers to you, darling. This is delicious. This is so light and refreshing. You look back and it's completely gone. Yeah, they go down fast. What I call the adult spa drink. <laughs> exactly. I'm like, where is the masseuse? <laughs> and right this here. one, I love the jalapeno, the spice. So Carl, these drinks are amazing, but what do you think about food? Here we go. So we have our appetizers, our entrees. We have our seasonal prefix and our vegetarian prefix. A little bar snacks on the bottom. If you need any suggestions, let me know. Everything's amazing. Well, I'm a vegetarian, but I eat fish once in a while, so I would love to do the vegetarian prefix if you're down to maybe do a little share. Yeah, things. share, and I think we should try some fish as well. What do you yeah. think about Kampachi looks amazing. Kampachi's great. And then what do you recommend for another fish option? I either go prawns or salmon. How about you surprise us? All right. Thank you. Great, thank you. One of the fun things about Hatfields is its open kitchen. Not only is it a beautiful centerpiece to the restaurant, but it's really fun to watch the chefs at work. Here we ladies go. Thank you. So for you, Kat, we have the watermelon avocado burrata salad with the mizuna with the hazelnut pesto. What is mizuna? Mizuna is like a Japanese arugula. Ooh, I, I have an obsession with arugula. Yes. Awesome. I flew to Japan this morning and brought it here. Oh, oh fantastic. Yeah. Mm, fresh. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You might hear, we have the Hawaiian kapachi with jicama, avocado, roasted peanuts, and a little black crumb fresh on the bottom. Bon appetit. Adding watermelon to any salad makes for a cool and hydrating treat. And did you know that it's an aphrodisiac? Mm, it's like an everlasting gobstopper. <laughs> it's all so fresh. This is so light. You have to try this. But I have to take another bite first. Yes. <laughs> Wow, you can really taste the freshness of the kapachi. Here we go. Second course, sweet corn ravioli, Ooh. cherry tomatoes, fava beans, and English peas. Yum. Enjoy. Bon appetit. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. beautiful. Shall I take, take the first bite? <laughs> Please. Here we go. I don't eat a lot of pasta, but when I do, I want it to taste this good. The fresh corn was a sweet flavor, perfect for the season. Wow. Here we ladies go. Ooh. We have the wild mushroom crepe. Oui, oui. A little fine herb spread on the bottom and uh, marinated beets for the vibrant beet ladies. Ooh, it looks amazing. It's like a twist on the traditional crepe. Every dish at Hatfields is a beautiful piece of edible art. It tastes like a garden exploded in my mouth. The beet provides hardiness and substance to any meatless dish. And really an interesting texture. And the uh, charred uh, paprika prawns with the creamy fava beans and a, a green mango on top, and it's a chamole of olive puree on the bottom. You know, it's nice too that it's small, because it's not something that you need in great proportion. Well, it is nice to try a series of these things kind of tapas style. This is a special drink I came up with. Nice little sip and drink for you to share. Thank you so much, Carl. Everything has been so incredible. The awesome, food is awesome. out of control. The service is exquisite. The vibrant beat says thank you. And I must say, this ending drink looks incredibly vibrant as well. So nice. we're walking. Cheers. A perfect end yes. to the perfect night.